up now on 14 minutes till 7, and we're taking action for anybody looking for a job this morning. The folks at Tampa Bay Workforce Alliance say they're seeing an uptick in hiring right now in one particular industry. So they're trying something new to funnel more candidates into those jobs. Our Ashley Glass has been digging into this. She joins us live now in the studio with the details. Pretty exciting, Ashley. It is, Dia. Good morning. Workers are wanted for manufacturing jobs here in the Bay Area. For the first time in years, manufacturing companies are adding jobs locally instead of cutting them by the thousands. And if you're interested, now is the time to apply. Let me show you how. Sixteen men. Training to work with machinery. Now we're ready to actually cut apart. Not a one more grateful than Zedrick Dunn. I was at my breaking point. Out of work for a full year, Zedrick caught a break with this bus. Everybody on this bus trailer is pretty serious about working. And there you go, you made your first piece. It's something new Tampa Bay Workforce Alliance is trying, sending qualified candidates to this bus that travels all over the country to train for jobs in manufacturing. After two weeks of class, every person in here is not only trained in a new job, but they're guaranteed to be placed in a new job, and some start immediately. And we're training this class with Workforce Florida grant money, state money, so it costs nothing for the company or the trainee. It takes a lot to get to this point. Absolutely. Uh, you know, we have really great retention rates because of our pre-screening and selection. There's a drug test you have to pass, national background check, a basic education test, a behavioral interview. Plus Plus, you have to be unemployed. You don't qualify if you're trying to jump from another job. Zedrick fits the bill. His training class fittingly called the chosen few. It's kind of like I'm seeing the light at the end of the tunnel. He starts his new job with Tampa Brass and Aluminum. Monday morning, 7 a.m., sharp. Zedrick's class actually graduates today, and he tells me he will take his family out to eat with his first paycheck. Most of the jobs start at $12 an hour, and there is room to grow. Tampa Bay Workforce Alliance is already gathering candidates, too, for the next time this bus comes to town, which could be in August. I posted an article on the front page of ABCActionNews.com, and Dia, it tells you exactly how to apply for anyone interested. We all love Zedrick. We're so happy that he got a job. He's a great Zedrick. guy. <laughs>